G'day World Wide Web, Lou Dub with another edition of Personal Best. It's the listed Roy Higgins quality, where Skymax, the German bread stayer, started favourite. Sets, and away they go. Skymax jumped away well, it was a beautiful line really. Nelson's not far away from the action with also Rudimental. And out wide, stars of Karam and Good Idea. Initially leading is Skymax as they run to the judge with a lap of headquarters to go from Good Idea and stars of Karam. Two lengths, Rudimental, and then came Nelson on the fence from Mosh Music. Ripcord second last, sin to win his last. Good Idea moves up on the outside of Skymax as they leave the straight. Two further back to stars of Karam. A length and a half, Nelson. Nelson fourth the rails. One off the fence, rudimental. Two lengths, ripcord, mosh music, sin to win last. To the riverside, 2,000 metres to go. And it is Skymax who leads pretty comfortably here for Karen McAvoy by a length. In second place, the outside, good idea. Two lengths away, stars of Karam is on the outer of Nelson, who is a lot closer today. Two further back, rudimental. And then came ripcord at the 1,700 metres. Mosh music second last. And sin to win, who has plenty of experience winning over the longer trips at Flemington at the tail. 1,600 metres to run, and at a fair speed, it's Skymax the leader by a length and a half. Good idea is second, and Nelson is tugging its way up a bit closer. Third in the box seat. Fourth in the race, stars of Karam at the 1,400 metres. A length and a half away, ripcord and rudimental, and then came towards the end, sin to win on the inside of Mosh Music, and there's no pressure on. Skymax is uh, relaxing the tempo even more as they reach the 1,200 metres from Good Idea. A length and a half, stars of Karam, and then came Nelson, who wants this a little bit faster. Two lengths away, if that rudimental and ripcord, and then Mosh Music and sin to win last as this smallish field pack. It's only five lengths first to last. 900 metres to go. Every chance in the lead for Skymax. By a neck to good idea. A length and a half stars of Karam. Then came Nelson. The inside hits a flat spot here as they're about to quicken. Followed by Rudimental and Ripcord from Mosh Music and Sin to win as they come up towards the turn. 600 metres to go. It's good idea. Now serving it up to Skymax. And Karen McAvoy is just getting a little bit fidgety. Stars of Karam a length and a half away. Then came Nelson who's just ridden along and given a reminder. Also, Ripcord making up some ground. Mosh Music sin to win to the outside. So the race is on at the 350. Stars of Karam takes the lead from Mosh Music. Then Skymax, who's beaten, and sin to win down the outside. Stars of Karam, 200 to go, joined by Mosh Music. Stars of Karam and Mosh Music. Mosh Music gets a 10 in front, then sin to win, and that's the race. Mosh Music, 100 metres to go, surges to the lead by a length and a quarter. Sin to win, and it's Mosh Music. Mosh Music won it. Sin to win second. Stars of Karam third, then Skymax, good idea. Well, Nelson was getting going again. Needs another Six-year-old mare, Mosh Music, the winner. If you've read the Lou Dub Personal Best website and followed my advice in the article four to follow, you would have done your dough. So I wrote up Skymax as something of a talented stayer. Didn't pan out for him on Saturday, though. It did pan out for Mosh Music, and she is now heading for the Two Mile Adelaide Cup on Monday the 8th of March. And here's a look at some fixed odds markets for the Adelaide Cup. Here is the TAB. They've got Charlie Rose number four, the favorite. And Ladbrokes is the same. Charlie Rose is a short price favorite, $1.85. If you like great staying races, be sure to subscribe to my channel at BitChute. Recently, racing.com conspired with YouTube to have my channel cancelled because I use some of their content. So make sure you subscribe to me at BitChute. There's a little less of the bullshit over there.